So with the release of the new DJI Mavic 2 Pro and Mavic 2 Zoom, you'd probably think that there is a huge difference between them considering the Pro version, well, has the word professional in its name, but that's really not the case. How's it going guys, Billy here with Drone DJ, and today we're going to be comparing the Mavic 2 Pro and Mavic 2 Zoom. <laughs> So the only difference between these two drones is the camera. The performance is the same, the flight time is the same, the transmission system is the same, it features the same amount of obstacle avoidance sensors around the body, and even the remote controller is completely identical. With the camera being the biggest difference here, you might be inclined to go for the Mavic 2 Zoom as it has a lot of the same new software features like hyperlapse, and it also costs $250 less than the Pro version. Now to really kick things off here, I first want to show you some footage from both drones to set a basis, so I'll be back with you guys guys after that footage is done playing. So the video from both of these drones looks fantastic, and some people will raise the question, why do I need to spend more money on this better camera when the Zoom's footage still looks so crisp? To which I would respond, the sensor in the Pro is larger, but there are some smaller differences that make its camera fundamentally a better choice for professionals trying to find that perfect blend between the best quality they can possibly shoot and portability. So after we looked at the footage from both of those drones, you might already have a good idea at which you think looks best, or at least if you think the Pro looks looks any better than the zoom, but now I want to go over all the important spec differences on paper. First up, sensor size. The 1 by 2 3rd inch sensor of the Mavic 2 zoom is smaller than the 1 inch sensor on the Mavic 2 Pro, bringing you more detailed images and better low light performance. With these sensor sizes, the zoom shoots 12 megapixel images, while the Pro shoots 20 megapixel images. Further improving nighttime shooting, the Mavic 2 Pro has an ISO range of 100 to 6400 when shooting video and 100 to 12 1,800 when taking photos. The zoom on the other hand has a range of 100 to 3200 both when shooting video and photos. While the extra ISO range is nice, if you raise the ISO too high, you'll get a ton of grain in the image. Focusing on photos for a second, the Pro's camera is able to take photos in a resolution of 5,472 by 3,648 in three different aspect ratios, 4x3, 3x2, and 16x9. With the zoom, photo sizes are only shot in a resolution of 4000 by 3000 and you only have the options of a 4x3 aspect ratio and a 16x9 aspect ratio, so you can't shoot any higher resolution photos and you also can't fit as much into the frame. This is one thing that drove me crazy about the camera of the original Mavic Pro and the Mavic Air. So those are all the important direct comparisons that I could make between the Pro and Zoom, but now let's go over what makes each of these cameras special. So starting off with the Zoom, we have this camera that can zoom in two times optically for lossless quality between 24 millimeters and 48 millimeters. It can even zoom in four times, adding a digital zoom on top of that optical zoom when shooting in 1080p, which let me just say is absolutely nuts. The image quality is still really good. With the help of the Zoom's camera, we can also take dolly shots where the drone is moving one way and the camera is zooming in or out the opposite way. We can also shoot photos in what's called super res with the help of image stitching, producing a 48 megapixel image. The Mavic 2 Pro's camera, on the other hand, has an adjustable aperture between f2.8 and f11, making it easy to properly expose photos and videos. It also has the ability to shoot in the D-Log M color profile, which includes benefits like HDR video and 10-bit color, so if you're someone that likes grading your video, you'll love playing with that flat footage that comes from this drone. So yeah, that's about all of the differences between the Mavic 2 Pro and the Mavic 2 Zoom's camera. There's not a single difference between them when it comes to looking at the aircraft, but if you're someone that doesn't mind spending a little extra money when purchasing
purchasing a drone, I'd recommend the Mavic 2 Pro. The zoom feature is great, and you can get some really awesome looking shots, but I really don't find myself using it all that much. Now before I end this video, I quickly want to play this footage back from the Mavic 2 Pro. Ungraded, it might look bad, I mean, I wouldn't want to upload this straight to YouTube or share it with family, friends through Facebook, but once it's color graded, it turns into something that just can't be shot with the Mavic 2 Zoom. So there we have it guys, those are all the differences between the Mavic 2 Pro and the Mavic 2 Zoom. There's not a single difference except for the two cameras, and as you can probably already tell, my favorite is the Mavic 2 Pro, but let me know what you guys think down in the comments if you own either of these drones. Anyway, thanks for watching guys, and I'll catch you in the next video.